Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. We are going to be showing you how to create a river system on your map. So let's jump straight into the Reforger tools. We will load up our map project. Go straight into the world editor. And we shall load our map. So here we are. This is Gotham City Island. Still under construction. I've been very busy recently, so I haven't had a chance to really do it, do much. So what we'll do is we'll find a nice little area. I'm just going to place a small one here just to show you how to do it. So at the top here, we will click Terrain Tools. Make sure Terrain Tool on the bottom right selected. Go to Sculpt. We will select Flatten. And whatever height your world is set at, so if it's um, when you created your height map, if you put 0 to 10 being the highest, you'd probably put down a 5 maybe. I messed up with my height map, so my height is 200, and I'll show you what this does. So we just make this smaller, we just click and drag we got ourselves a little channel okay uh, we could probably raise this to 210 so if i go back 210 go drag there you go now we'll select the vector entity tool we'll select a new polyline and we will place it at the very start. And we will control click all the way along this area, making sure to get all the little curves. Then click right at the end, and there it is. So now we have our spline shape entity on the left on the hierarchy. We'll go to the resource browser, search for river, and you'll find it under Armory Forger, Prefab Library, Generators, Water, River, and you'll have r underscore river medium 01.et. Drag that and drop it onto your polyline. Now it's not very good at the moment, so what we'll do is go to the object properties in the bottom right. Scroll to the bottom, we will increase the width to encompass the entire section. We can adjust the offset, just up or down. And if need be, we can just raise some of these splines. Just like that, just adjust it. So you don't get any of this flickering. This is because my map is quite iffy. And we'll just raise that one slightly there. So now as you can see, it's not quite there. So we click back onto the river medium on the hierarchy. Scroll back down. Increase the width just a bit to cover all the little cutouts. That is exactly how you make a river hope that helps enjoy creating your maps and until the next one take care